All right, it realistically can't be better than an ability that doubles her special attack step. But she could be a physical attacker too. You know, who's to say really? Jesus fuck. I can swap mid battle from doubling my special attack stat into Moxie. And somehow they're both very good on Diancie. Like. Endeavor, dude. If it wasn't a double battle, I could have Rillaboom come out, put Electric Terrain up, eat a hit, and Endeavor. One of them done to nothing. Mixed attacker, Diancie's wild. Yeah, but it's not like at will. It's like I have to swap, you know? All right, give that back to her. I could just go see what this fight looks like. If there's ever a point I get Silver Ledge out there, I can guarantee Silver Ledge goes first. Cell Relegibility is Speed Boost. So after literally one turn, Cell Relegibility should be outspeeding everything. Dragon Claw, what was it Substitute? Substitute Swords Dance, something like that was the strategy I wanted. Electric Terrain boosts electric type moves. And no sleep. Rick, thank you for the tier yeah. 374. Oh, Silver Ledge doesn't learn Swords Dance. Ain't that a bitch? Silver Ledge doesn't learn. No, he's got to already know it. He's got to already know it. Yeah, he already knows it. Phew, thank fuck. Um, okay. He needs a ghost type attack. Shadow Claw, there it is. We'll do Shadow Claw over Psycho Cut. Honestly, I don't even think you need Flare Blitz when you have Bitter Blade, so. Clear smog. Solar blade for the sun. Defog gets rid of terrains, really? Did the psychic terrain come out? The psychic terrain came out because of the tapu, right? That first tapu he throws out does that. What up, SSL? How you doing? Because if that first tapu he throws out is what defogs, I can clear that frame one. The only problem is Scraggy. I need Scraggy to be dead. Rick should be a menace out here in theory, but... Does Scraggy outspeed Rick? No way, right? Let's try this. All right, one more time. Here we go. Team is leveled up. Some of these guys gone up literally more than 10 levels. Let's take the faster way up here, shall we? I remember the path now. We are Legion. Chat where the people stares at. I don't think this is yeah, okay. I'm 
Moonblast would KO Scrafty. If I get Diancy out there instead of Diamond Storming. Okay. I guess I'll pick him later. If I lead with Diancy. Because there's no way that motherfucker ain't gonna know Focus Blast. Diancy might just beat the shit out of this whole thing. First of all, look at that special defense stat. Look at that regular defense stat. Look at the fact that I can raise my defense. Like, Diancy is nothing to fuck with. Look at this, Diancy. I don't think Tapu could even look at us. What if I... I, I kind of want to lead with her... One shot Scrafty with Moonblast and then just start Diamond Storming. Just to see what happens. Because this Diancy was holding her own just a minute ago and she was level 68. Facing level 82s and shit. That's not even like the best strategy I have, I think. But it's the one that I want to use. Because I think the best strategy I have is start with Rick and get rid of Psychic Terrain Frame 1. But I just want to see how fucking busted this Diancy is. I also bought Rillabo uh, Rillaboom, just in case, also. Um, oh, wait, hold on. I forgot to put the Scarf on Garchomp. Nice. Not that it matters, he's still outsped by everything, I guess. Cell has speed boost. Do I want Cell here? Oh, where the fuck is True at? I need True. Moxie from Scrafty KO. Alright, let's try Diancing all the things. Have Rick as a backup, and we'll have True in there also. We can swap this team around a bit. We'll see what the fuck is up. All right, Psychic Surge. I'm gonna Moonblast you until you die. So Tapu Lele gets low. Tapu Lele counter Moonblast. Dragapult lives these barely. Oh, they're teaming up on Dragapult now instead of True, which sucks because Dragapult was doing hella damage. But you know what you've done? You've let the fucking god run free. Because Tapu Lele dies to Diamond Storm now. Diamond Storm don't do fuck all to him, though. Fuck, Exadrill's a good, uh... A good cock block here. Oh, Mega Salamence got Aqua Tail, though. Iron Head incoming. He'll outspeed me. God damn! Bitch is almost dead! Fuck. Alright, Tapu Lele gotta die. By the way, Diancy just dropped two of these bitches. I don't know if you guys were there for that or not. I don't know why he didn't Iron Head me. Rock Slide probably to hit both of us. Make sure it kills. Celestia? Dialga is Lance's last Pokemon. Which sucks ass. Meanwhile, my bitch ass still gotta go through a Mewtwo. I'm gonna keep Diamond Storming everything, though. This sucks. Overflowing with space power? What the fuck do you mean his bitch ass is overflowing with space power? You made that up. Defense buff. Doesn't really matter. Motherfucker got a T-Tar. Alright, Diancy goes down. Dialga body press T-Tar. Does T-Tar die? Fuck. Okay, it's me against the fucking world here. Let me tell you how much this shit sucks ass. Hmm. 
Okay, don't let nobody ever say a Diancy didn't put in the goddamn work. Why this bitch got flamethrower? Like, who asked you to do that? I didn't mean to... Whatever. Ooh, not that one. Yeah, no, Diancy put in a crazy amount of work, so if I lead with Rick instead... Or fuck it, dude, fuck Rick. What if I just lead Rillaboom? What if I just lead with Rillaboom and then let Rillaboom die? Get rid of that Godforsaken uh, Psychic Surge bullshit. Rillaboom ain't gonna do shit, but he's not supposed to do shit, you know? Enter, enter, that's my fucking goat. Electric Surge, bitch. Okay, they're picking on Rillaboom. That's good, because that means Dragapult lives around. I could go into True. And try to kill something with Flame Charge. Get a Speed Boost and a Moxie Boost. And build up that. But maybe we'll save that for later. Shadow Ball, Tapu Lele gone. Drain Punch, suck my ass, die to Moonblast. Okay. Uh, both these bitches are Steel type. This is bad for me. I'm going to try to raise my defense. Dragapult got an answer. Oh, the burn is huge. The burn is huge. I'm doing this in hopes of a defense raise, because if I get my defense raise, it's possible Diancy lives through these. Extra Drill dies to burn here, too. Oh, Celestia sucks ass. And we got... Oh, we got the defense buff. Extra Drill dead to burn. No Psychic Surge. What are you going to do about it, bitch? Now Mewtwo comes out. Okay. Pressure actually sucks, because Diamond Storm... Uh only get a couple diamond storms. I can always reload it and raise my PP. Don't know what the fuck stole robbery is. Literally not a clue. Posing you two stole. Oh, it stole my defense buff, you little whore. It steals your defense buff and attacks. Why is he so busted in this game? I mean, like, he's busted in every game. This is just extra weird. You two might die to Diamond Storm. Actually, they're bo they both might die to Diamond Storm. Let's fuck Diancy! Oh, shit, dude. I think I die. I'm like, do I Diamond Storm them both or do I Moonblast Titar? But I probably don't live this anyway. This stupid bitch ass. Oh, look at Diancy eating that shit! It don't even hurt, dog! Titar helps you because Sandstream buffs your special defense. No shit. Do we live a crunch? God, look at this thing. Plus 50% special defense for rock types in the sand. Yeah, that is nuts. Hits Mewtwo a little bit. Dialga heals a little bit. And like... You could kill me, bro, but I don't know. This Diancy's a fucking issue. I told y'all when we saw that. Assault Vest on this thing? You got an insane defense stat. You got an insane special defense stat. And you got an insane special attack stat. Like, what more do you want? Okay. No matter what I have left here, Dialga cleans up. And I got the fucking god left. What are you going to do to this man? 
You died a sandstorm. Yeah, I can only pick one of us, fucker. Later, Diago. Sorry, Lance isn't good enough to handle it. But I'll finish this job alone if you don't mind. Eat shit, Giovanni, you dork. Oh, I really got bailed out by Diancy. I don't know what I do with that Diancy there. The fact that it's got fucking diamond cum and it hits both mons. Even with Mega Mewtwo, I'm a bitch. I'm truly humbled. My plan for world domination is but a dream. I threw I threw aside my family for this. Abandoned my wife, even my own son. Despite my defeat at Sylphco, I couldn't give up on my plan. I admit I was a victim of the sunken cost fallacy. But I've given up literally everything for this. Boss! What? Archer? Ariana? Knights, thank you for the stream streak. Not everything, sir. You still have us? Please, sir, have faith in us. We've sucked your dick through thick and thin. You could learn to rely on us, even if it's just a little. Could you have any doubt on our loyalty? Ever since you took us in when we were lowly children, with no home to go, you abandoned your own son and raised us instead for some reason, like we were the sons you already had. This is pretty fucking weird. My crude ambitions have blinded me. You guys are more than family. Nani, you two escaped out of my master ball. Fuck ass. When you are worthy, please return to me. Ha! What in the fuck? He forced us out of his dome. Dude, we were in Mewtwo's domain expansion and I still beat him. We were in the middle of Mewtwo's domain expansion and I still beat him. Mewtwo deemed me unworthy. And he spoke to you. Perhaps he's waiting on you to become champion. Give me a Mewtwo eye or something. Giovanni, you're a bitch. Hope to see better things out of you. On behalf of the Pokemon League, I'll be kicking your ass anytime I see you for the foreseeable future. Anyway, this feels right in your hand. Mewtwo White, why? Archer, Ariana, I'm indebted to both of you. Now your adventure begins. Thank you, fuckass. We hope to meet again when you're champion. Deeply apologize for being a bitch. Take care of yourself, fuckass. I've handed my position as gym leader to somebody else already, and if you run into Silver, tell him I'm sorry. Farewell. Oh, I bet... I wonder if Blue is, uh... Gym leader. That was a strange turn of events. Maybe it would have been wise not to let him go, but I do get the feeling he came to his senses. Maybe I'm naive. Thank you for assisting me. Here, I have this for you. Salamancite. He did mention the name Silver. I've actually ran into that kid a couple times. He was once a snotty brat, and he got even dumber as he grew older. Anyway, take care, fuckass. I'll see you in the Pokemon League soon. Oh, this poor little girl watched the whole thing. When you're worthy, bitch, I just kicked your ass. Yeah. That was quite the long uh, cutscene, but it's the longest we've had, so... Does Giovanni really deserve to be called a bitch? Yeah, he just kept... He lost. Every single time we were in him, he just lost. What up, Miles? All right. Teams looking, how the team's looking. We have Diancy, so the game is now easy. I mean, I think that every time I get a super broken thing. But this Diancy is actually snapped. Like, like uncomparably, nothing is more snapped than this. All right, we got to prepare for old ground type, Jim. Mm, maybe not Alteria. Oh, where's Urshi at? Mm-hmm. Sucking on my balls. Brady and Gym Leader has returned. Do I tell the rules? No, dude. I want you to tell me about the goddamn gym leader. Oh, what the fuck? Is this Claire?
Am I about to take on a dragon gym? Oh, shit. Well, this changes things a little bit. Fucking dragon gym. Swampert learned an ice type move. I don't know if I have anybody with a good ice type attack other than Aurorus, but Aurorus is really under leveled right now. Diancy Moonblast about to go sicko. Yeah. Let's just see how this looks. Ice Punch on Swampert. I don't know if I have the TM for Ice Punch. Oh, I have Triple Axel, which nobody can learn. I have Ice Spinner, which nobody can learn. Which Mon turn? Oh, we have a Hitmonchan with Pixelate. <laughs> if I need to go train something up, we do have a Hitmonchan with Pixelate, which I could easily slap a, uh, a scarf onto or something. I don't have Ice Punch. Go figure. How hard is the Elite Four in this game? You know, it's supposed to be insane. Gym leader of the Kanto region. I was once a leader in Johto. This is nothing new to me. Lance may be considered the world's Dragon Master, but I'm a close second. You still want to take me on? Let's do this. Ice Punch isn't familiar. I'll go look for it if I need to. This is not a good lead. I wasn't going to Swords Dance. Uh oh! Somebody got a speed boost! This is another Mon that's been busted, but he's been too low a level for me to use him until now. This is Cell Relege with Speed Boost. It's a tutor move? Ooh. Wow, he ate that shit. Shadow Claw has a high crit chance, so if I crit here, he dies. If I don't crit here, I lose the battle. Fuck. Um, this is where I would need Raichu, because Raichu's the only one priority. True could maybe take a hit. Diancy can maybe take a hit. Oh, they're scared. Oh, they're scared, scared. Hoping I would get every buff possible. Can't hurt. So, let me get this straight. The Dragon Trainer has a Steel Fairy type. Why didn't I foresee this? You fucking piece of shit. Oh, I'm getting hit with Mon Fury Cannon if we want to know what kind of trainer Claire is. In case anyone was curious as to what kind of trainer <laughs> Claire is, I just got hit with Mon Fury Cannon. For everyone keeping score at home. Piece of shit. What in the fuck? Oh, Roaring Moon? Why does he look like this? This is, this is Roaring Moon Pokemon Sun Edition. I'm actually locked into Earthquake. Which does a lot. And I should still outspeed because I am Scarfed. Nope, slowest Pokemon ever. Ha! Silly me, I forgot Garchomp is actually the slowest Pokemon of all time. And now I'm dead. And he's Dragon Dancing. And fuck, I'm going to die. We eat those. We eat those. Dragon dance as many times as you want. You ain't doing shit against Diancy. In hardcore, you're not even allowed to use... What the fuck is this? This bitch is a poison dragon. Am I dead? Assault vest? This is an Ultra Beast? I've never seen this thing before in my life. 
Times two special attack, no biggie. No, they updated Hyper Art. It's got it all. Only one left. This is where the battle really begins. Claire, you ever, you ever thought about eating shit? Oh, this is the bridge. It's the fucking bridge to Terabithia or whatever the fuck it is. They're updating it again soon, really? I, I would have thought they'd be about done with it by now. How's Radical Red tonight? Going really good. We got past Giovanni, which was an insane fight. But now that we're past old Geo, we're kind of uh, freaking and vibing. He Draco meteored. I was like, no way I get one shot. He Draco meteored already. Perish. He Draco meteored once already. He already Draco meteored once. He already Draco meteored once! Um, we had that fight though. Him taunting frame one sucks ass, but it is what it is. We use it to our advantage. Shadow Claw, Shadow Claw, Shadow Claw. We die. He is so scared of Diancy, he swaps out. What did he swap into? He didn't swap into Megirna, he swapped into some other shit. Did he swap straight into Megirna? If he swaps straight into Megirna, then I can go into Garchomp. Or Swampert. I don't remember what I did with Swampert last time. Yeah, fucking Mon Fury Cannon coming in hot. Earthquake, Roaring Moon. Earthquake, now we're outsped, we live. Um, now I first turn swap into Diancy because this dude can eat shit. Dual wing beat does nothing. I go for ancient power and hopes for the everything buff. That's me being wishful thinking. She's acting different this time. She went into jet fuel. And I know Rick dies in one hit. I think, I think it's the exact same thing as last time. I think I just lose. We live this one. Okay, we're triple speed. We have a moxie boost. Nice. Is it over? Yeah, it's over. Fuck. Eat shit. Eat shit. Your skills are rather mysterious. Fine, have a rising badge. I knew that that battle was not going to be that hard because I Rick didn't do anything, so I could have swapped Rick out for a whole ass Pokemon and been fine. I knew after the first one we were good, or during the first one we were good. Uh, years of being defeated as gym leader have changed my perspective. She's been defeated like three times, four. I don't know why she's bitching about losing all the time. Although I haven't been humbled like that in a while. Take this, Dragon Pulse. And a Daruda Standstormite. Becomes a non-stop barrage of Dracos. It's quite satisfying. Also, if you show me a dragon type, I can teach it Draco Meteor. Ooh, does anybody want to know Draco Meteor? Rick? Rick wants to know Draco Meteor. I mean, over Defog, fuck it, you know? Anybody know what my current level cap is? Shit. Fuck ass! 
Oh, it's not a battle. I'm one of Oak's aides. We just wanted to congratulate you on getting all the badges. Now that you're strong enough, this information will be helpful. Roaming legendaries have appeared. You can view them on your town map. They're powerful, although they may be difficult to catch. That's all for me. Good luck. How am I going to know what the roaming legendaries are if I'm... If I'm in random? Oh, there's a lot of them. There's a fuck ton of them. guys are all over is my no my level cap can't still be 82 it was 82 before I fought Giovanni and then I beat Giovanni and then I beat Claire I also don't know how I'm gonna find these guys shit what fuck ass what a surprise to you here you go to the Pokemon League collect all the badges I'll, then I'll uh, I'll whip you as a warm-up for the Pokemon League. All right, I guess we're doing this. Do I live a Brave Bird? I don't think he has a re I don't think he has a move that uh counters me here. What is that green snail-looking legendary? That's a uh, Scarlet Violet. That's one of the. One of the Chinese legendaries locked behind the big circle walls. By the way, this is Swords Dance Speed Boost Cell Relege. For anybody who's never seen him before. If you talk to the nurse on the right side of the Pokemon Center, let's... Oh, I didn't know that. Thank you. Uh, Booster Energy Iron Moth. Maybe I should have bitter bladed again anyway for the health. Fuck, he lived. We eat those? We eat those. Give me two health back. Would you ever do a shiny playthrough? I don't think I have the patience to only catch shinies. I've done I've done shiny hunting before, but I've never just done a playthrough of only shinies, especially in Radical Red, where it feels like getting shinies is pretty difficult. Uh, Blastoise eats this. Blastoise eats this, and we go down. But this is still a really good run for Cellar Ledge. Speed Roost Cellar Ledge is gross. How you doing, Catalyst? And we crit though. What a what a G. What a legend. Alright, where is Raichu when I need him? I should have Raichu whenever I swamp it right now. Oh, got a little scared, did we? Um, I don't have a fighting type out right now either. What up, Jace? Alright, knock off. That shit hurted. And he sucker punched me, I'm guessing. All right, Moxie boost on the scarf. Oh, we lived. What the fuck? Did not expect to live that. No priority move. Double Moxie did have a focus sash. Um, do I just Diancy everything? You turn, you bitch. Oh, Blastoise. Blastoise died. Nani, I was just careless. That loosened me up. I'm ready for the poke. Wow, they bro said I loosened him up. I know Vulpix and Ninetales Shiny is really pretty. That's why I want it. Yeah. Um, the Alolan version, too. Level cap. Current level cap. Wow, it's still 82. Wow, okay. I've beaten three bosses. They've still locked me at 82. He wanted to whip you and get loosened up. <laughs> what a guy. Ow. 
I don't have a proper like A team right now. I have three very good fire types. I have a couple decent water types. Um, anybody know off the top of their head what level the roaming legendaries are? I've never made it this far in the game before. Well, they're all on not this side of the map, so never mind. Also, because they're randomized, they won't be ro they won't be roaming. 60? Okay, so in theory, I just need to put a 59, a level 59 mon on around and then run around in those spots, right? I'm assuming the deck snap won't show me if they're nearby. Oh, wait a minute! I definitely already have a Draco's ult. So I don't know why it's not showing up here. We got a lot of Mon we can catch in this neighborhood. We got a what the fuck is this? We got a lot of Mon we can catch in this in this neck of the woods. Asui and Gudra's big ass. Oh, wait. I gotta change the box. Level 3 Hisui and Gudra seems legit. Yeah. Cresselia has always been one of my favorites, man. I have always loved me a Cresselia. You have Arctazolt, not Dracozolt. There's different one of these losers. These guys look so weird. I don't even like them. But you're right. I do not have this one. I could look at the tea kettle, but isn't the tea kettle's base ability what makes it good? What does reset mean? Oh, like it just goes back to my day and night cycle? That's kind of cool. How are we doing tonight? Pretty good. How did you get the Poke Vital? I don't remember. It was so long ago now. Fucking spritzy, dude. Oh my god, in the water, the mousehold family's there. Scissor right? Okay. I don't think I have scissor. Alright. Help them, they're drowning! Let's see if any of these guys are worth a shit. Uh, let's start with Gudra. Cute charm, thirty percent chance to infatuate on contact. On contact, that's okay. Nothing really to write home about. Let's look at this weird ass Pikachu. Motor drive raises speed if hit by an electro. That would make Electro Ball really good. Cotton down is not bad for Cresselia. The problem is Cresselia is not the speediest, so it had to get hit multiple times before it mattered. Are you checking hidden abilities? No, that's too tedious. Technically, that is Cresselia's hidden ability, because I caught it with a dream ball. Raises speed if hit by an electric move on an electric dragon. Emergency exit. Stamina. Boost defense when hit by an attack. I caught this thing at level 54. Boost defense when hit by an attack. Mm, that's not too bad. But, bunch of strikeouts. See, Botchamania, Sting's final match. They used Call an Ambulance, but not for me when they did a big move on him and he knows sold it. That's funny. Those motherfuckers be moving. That's a boulder badge. Go right ahead. You got it, Chief.
Looking for a hidden item. They made this uh, little path so weird. Like, I get that there's areas that you surf through and stuff, but the fact that some of it is kind of a mazy, but it's not like a hard maze at all or anything, it's always a little goofy to me. Well, well, well. If there isn't a goat in the neighborhood. I think I'm out of dive balls. I have one dive ball left. I didn't really check the watermon back there either. No, nope, nothing new. Okay. Punk rock boost sound moves by fuck, dude. That's useless. I need that on X Splat or something. seen a single Snorlax, but a Mega Snorlax? A snorlax I An actual Fire Red, wasn't there a small chance of finding the legendary- one of the legendary dogs. Yeah, after you beat the whole game, you get a call, and... Your starter, like if you pick a Fire-type starter, your rival picks a Water-type starter, uh, you would get the Electric-type, you would get Raikou. But you get whatever that third type is. If you pick Squirtle, your rival picks Bulbasaur. Then you would get uh, Entei as the roaming. Oi! Wait up, mate! Hey, me again. Sorry I couldn't help you further in the Cerulean Cave. I got destroyed by Archer and ran away in shame. Recently, I don't know. I'm not a bad trainer by any means. I can snag gym badges for sure, but I've always wanted to be an incredible trainer like my dad. I really thought as long as I put in the effort and work, I could be one of the best. But I could never put a dent in you. Trainers like Archer have shown me how far the gap between us has become. It's becoming clear to me I'm just not very strong, let alone talented. Is that what I'm missing? An innate trait some are just gifted with? I can't accept that. Yeah, I'm not sure what to say. I don't care, fuck ass. We're battling. I won't take no for an answer. Bro, you caught a goddamn Deoxys! I think we outspeed Deoxys after this turn. Focus Ash? Yeah. Fuck, dude. He's so fast. Uh, me with priority. Fucking Landorus, you bitch. I don't know who to go into here. Wow, nice critical hit. Did they... You ever try playing the game without easy mode? Um, let me see. I don't really have the team equipped for this. Nobody likes this guy. I haven't quick saved in a minute. Garchomp can take a hit a little bit better than I thought he could. Can Rachi even look at us? No. Yeah, all he's got is Zen headbutts. There we go. And hoping for a flinch. Water dark, dude. Fuck you. Got a weird game of Ring Around the Rosa going on here. And he shell smashed. God damn it, dude. Yeah, this sucks ass. Cannot fight Dragon Sceptile. All right, we ate one ground type attack. Fucking scale shot. Wait, that's good for me. He's dead. 
I think I can kill him with Raichu now. Raichu, low-key, high-key carry. I think I just have to zippy zap. He can't hurt me. Wow. Whoa. Fuck. All right. Well, I'm out of zippy zaps. So that's bad. I guess I'm dead, so that's also bad. Your bitch ass is flying, fighting. All right. Zippy zap would have done me wonders if I had one more. Needed a flinch. Okay. Um. Where is my last real save? All right. I either have to redo this battle or I have to faint before I can swap my team out because I didn't save before I walked in here. Knowing that he outspeeds me even after a speed boost sucks so much ass because that just means that I can't, uh... Well, I guess I couldn't, I couldn't Swords Dance into Shadow Claw anyway. And I can't hope for a crit. Or any of that nonsense. I wonder if... I wonder if Bitterblade... It, it won't. I wonder if Bitter, Bitterblade would do enough where I could live another Psychic. Or I could heal up enough to do another Psychic. Actually, we might live a psychic. Yeah, we live a psychic. Now we got a swords dance. And now we're faster than everything. Hold the fuck up. Does your bitch ass have something to stop me? Oh, yeah. All right. Intimidate hurts. Not going to lie. Blocking everything I want to do hurts. Yo, bro, fuck you. I'm going to Flare Blitz. You're getting a 1.5 times Flare Blitz. Now you can die to Zippy Zap. I could have Bitter Bladed, but I'm pretty sure I'm dead if I Bitter Blade. Yeah, fucking bitch ass. No way we're not faster here, right? I'm only level 74. Jesus, fuck. Why is he so fast? I thought he would shell smash. Yeah, I thought he would shell smash too. I haven't trained up Raichu in a while. Something I'm missing out on. I, I win the first fight that we do if I train up Raichu. All right, Bitter Blade. Get me back. Swords Dance. Bitter Blade again. If he's going to use Liquidation, I'm tempted to Bitter Blade just to see if I... I won't live Liquidation, but I'm tempted. Tempted to just see. Yeah, no, there's no way we live that. Okay. I go into Raichu. And he swaps into who? Who did he just swap into that fucked me up? Sceptile. He goes into Sceptile. And then he goes Mega Sceptile. Sceptile has a base speed of 145. Are you telling me he probably outspeeds? A what the fuck? You tell me he probably outspeeds a Scarf Garchomp. This is fine. This is just unexpected. I thought Garchomp did it. Do we die to Iron Head? Ooh, we eat Iron Head. Okay, Moxie boost. And you don't get hurt by Earthquake. Fuck. Okay. Um, back to this game because nobody likes this guy. This gives me a safe switch into who? What typing is he? I've always hated the Landorus, Thunderous. I've always hated the, the fucking Cloud guys so much. I never even learned their typings. He's ground something, right? What is he? Ground flying? Ground flying? Okay. So what hits him? Ice, which I don't have. I forget how I handled this guy last time. 
Diancy, I just rock blast. A little upset Diamond Storm doesn't hurt him like that. Alright, Diancy, we actually got a defense buff there. And with the defense buff, I might live whatever he does here. Yeah, I got a defense race from Diamond Storm. I need this to not hit five times. Towery! Finally let me hit the button. Thank you for the 16 months. Oh shit, we lucked out! Two of five, bitch! Moonblast! That was incredibly lucky. We got the defense raise, and then he rolled two of five on Bullet Seed. And if I'm not wrong, these last two guys are just simply handled by Raichu. Fake out, you ain't doing shit. Zippy zap, you're dead. Zippy zap. Youchers, that hurt. Zippy zap, piece of shit. I knew that fight was easy. I didn't have to swap mons. Just whatever I had on me. Just whatever I have on me will do, I guess. I'm discouraged. I know I shouldn't have shot for the stars, but the bottom line is I have a lot to learn. I'll be returning to Hoenn to train with my dad. Maybe I'll come back sometime. Or you could come visit me if you'd like. I know someday our paths will cross again. Still must thank you for always pushing me to my limit in case I never see you again. Take this. Septilite. Mega Stone for my favorite Pokemon. It really needs no introduction. <clears throat> Don't need to stick around to know you uh to see you win it all. You already ooze champion status. Don't disappoint me. So long, friend. I never liked you. Cap should be 85 now. Sick. Cell Relege is a monster. Cell Relege is huge. Diancy's huge. And let's see if we can get anything else in here. Licky Licky, Whale Lord. Okay. Okay. Because again, with this game, with the randomizer, you don't necessarily want a great Mon. You want a Mon with great base stats. So you can sit over there and pray that you, uh. You can sit over there and pray that it gets a good ability. Right? Don't underestimate the Victory Road Trainer. Every time I underestimate, I get my ass kicked. So I know what you're talking about. Also, I think I could train up on those Whale Lords if I need to, which is nice. Zeb Strikas, whatever. Heliosk, I'm not too sold on. So let's look. See what we got here. Licky Licky. Cotton down. Lowers everyone's speed when hit. Again, eh. Unaware Whale Lord. Okay. Una Whale Lord. That is something. Silver Ledge is a monster. Diancy is just God. Level 82 Caterpie. Sorry, little guy. Gotta get my level up so I don't run into Wild Mon anymore. Solago after a kill or two. Yeah. See, Solago, if Solago manages to get one or two kills with Flame Charge in there, then he outspeeds everything and one shots everything. Two hundred twenty special attack. Two hundred twenty special attack on what? Whale Lord. Um, same thing with Urshifu. Urshifu doesn't really have an ability, which sucks ass. But if I get one or two Trailblaze, if I get one or two, I guess the kills don't really matter. Urshifu. The thing that makes Urshifu kind of difficult is you have to get a you have to get a power up punch or two in, and you have to get a Trailblaze or two in. But it is what it is. All right, Victory Road Trainer, let me save my game. Let me pop a vial. Let me see what's up. I wonder if you're good enough for me. Well, if it isn't the Mousehold family beating me up. But then I did a swords dance and got a speed boost. <laughs> and now we're doing shit like this. Oh, I hate this bitch. Good thing I outspeed you. And I'm swords danced. Shininja! I fast-forwarded 
Did anybody see what happened? I was accidentally mashing the fast forward button a lot. Did anybody see what happened there? Where uh, I did a move and that was supposed to be super effective one shot kill it and then instead my move did nothing and I died. Was anybody paying attention for that one? God blinked. It had a focus sash? Oh, of course it did. I can see you're good. Let me see exactly how good. Oh, Cyclozar. Okay. Well, that hurts, but... I've swords danced and speed boosted. Youchers. Oh, he killed himself. Okay. Uh, fuck it. Garchomp. What do you got? Oh, bad lead. I'm gonna Earthquake anyway. What in the fuck is Mega Kingler? Almost dead. Okay, he's almost dead, but unfortunately for me, he knows a move called Ice Hammer. Crowbat! Zippy Zap. Katarine. I'm okay dying here. Ouch, that shit hurted. Oh, you're fairy type. Uh, this is me fucking up. This is what it looks like when I fuck up. That's on me. That's my bad, dog. I wasn't aware of your game. Alright, I have to reset this. So I'm going to do two things. Number one. Water, Steel, G-Max, Kingler. Oh, yeah, I keep forgetting they turn G-Maxes. I never knew... I never really knew any G-Maxes, you know? Like, I was aware of... Let me go to Nerd Joy just to refill my Poke Vials. I knew Pikachu. I knew Executor, because that one was funny. And then I knew Sniper's Nest and Tilion. I, other than that, I never really paid attention to any... G Max forms. Uh, chat, here's a question. Do you guys think our Moltres is going to be good or useless? Hisui and Typhlosion, you say? Nice, just get the one shot out, right? Silver Ledge is so fucking good. I don't think Panseer can hurt me that bad, so we're going to Swords Dance. Nice Latios, bro. If it had a G-Max, then that's a Mega in this game. Yeah, yeah. I think my problem is that I don't know what G-Maxes are outside of the three I mentioned for you just now. Moltres is going to be as good as, good as Kadarius Tony. That man caught one when it counted, all right? That's all I know. Or not Kadarius Tony. Oh, I'm thinking of Valdez Scantling. Never mind. That man did not catch one when it counted. To correct myself. Bitterblade is such a good move, dude. Holy shit. Is this your only guy? That poor little fucker. Snow Escape, what a find. I heard rumors of a child prodigy. Oh, shit. Oh, and you're dragon type, too. Can I live one? Not if I'm sleeping. Did not get a, a wake up. That sucks. Uh, I have to go to sleep and then get swapped out. Otherwise, I'm just going to keep getting slept over and over. He burned me on first turn! Jesus fucking Christ. I think I lose.
Just fucking spam and sleep powder. Oh wait, when did I battle this thing? There's the guy on the next floor. 